just here to pick up one of these thousand litre ICB things. I don't know if that's right. They're like a water tank and um, give them a bit of a rinse out. They're going to be sweet. So they got heaps of them here. Give Shield Coat a yell or shieldcoat.com.au, mate. I got two for a hundred bucks. Phew! Got me trolley ready. Phew! I've scored two for a hundred bucks. Give them a call. Just going to chuck one in right now, mate. Sweet! Sweet, there you go. Well, I've got my uh, big water tank home. Luckily, uh, I've got myself a big skateboard too. That's my trolley. Now, it's pretty important. You got to uh, you got to find somewhere with a whole heap of uh, sun and um, not too much uh, water around. And lucky enough, I found a spot with a good downpipe. So I'm going to plug the downpipe into the top in case we need to fill her up. So here we go, mate. Stage one. Got her home. Sweet. Sweet. Well, I've got my blueprints handy, so I know what I'm doing exactly. One of these is going to come in very handy. Going to be using them today. And me drill. Going to pull this apart, take the top off, and then we're going to cut him. So as you can see, the reservoir has one on the ground, two, three, four top rows of metal. The grow beds only have three. So if we count from the bottom, there's one at the bottom, one there, and one at the top, where the top of the plastic is. So that would mean we're going to go one, two, three. Now with the third one, we want obviously this bit as well of the metal. So we're going to cut it off just before it. So I've got a Nico. I'm going to go all the way around with the blue marker. Here's my blueprints again. I've uh, got a list of things that um, I can grow. I've worked out the um, tube in and out, how high it's going to be, how wide, all that. How much solar panel, because this is only going to be a little fountain pump. Because it only has to pump up there. And then I've got the direction. So the red is gravity. Going back to the fish tank down this thing. I'll show you a picture of now. Then we've got our gravel grow bed. As you can see here in the picture, you just put some stones and uh, volcanic, you know, it, um, no limestone in them. That's pretty much the only tip. And uh, wash them off good, get all the dirt off. And then after your seedlings grown, you get your little roots coming out the bottom. All you got to do is grab them and stick them in the rocks, mate. There you go. So it's going to go down that thing like that. Too easy. Now back to the blueprint, that's the grow bed, and uh, that's going to be a gravel one. Sweet, so if you've got the right tools, this is easy, get the top bars off, then mark it with the marker, slide it out, and uh, start cutting, mate. All good, you can have a little bit of uh, wastage, but only one gap. Keep everything, keep all the screws, they're going to come in handy. Then we're going to do the same. Flip it. One, two, three. So I'm going to cut him just on top of the third one. So we're only going to lose that bit of plastic and that bit of metal all the way around. All right, I've got my crayon on the side and tip that out. I've marked it. And, oi, is that my crayon? Give me that. Give me that. Cheeky puppy. Sweet, all right. Well, I'm, I've started it off with the hacksaw. Got myself a cordless jigsaw with a laser, laser line. So trying to keep that going. You can do it the whole way around with this, it takes a bit of effort, but uh, you'll get a lot neater probably if you do the hacksaw, mate. Too easy. Matilda helping like normal. Yeah, good on you, love. Oi. Okay, jigsaw is definitely the way to go with this, folks. Fully sweet. Cut right through, mate. Forget this thing. And you probably need a metal one to get through this too, mate. Luckily enough, I've got a little grinder. And all you have to do is cut there, and there, and we'll get rid of that little middle bit. And then the uh, plastic bit that is now that big will sit right in it perfectly, mate. Sweet. Sweet. Well, the grow beds are ready to have the auto bell siphon put in. You're going to make a little special piece of equipment to drain it automatically. It fills slowly, but then drains quickly. It's called a bell siphon. So I've done my best, didn't do too badly. Did mess up once, mate. 
Sweet. Sweet. Sweet.